Hello, welcome to Autopilot at Work. I hope everyone has been feeling well. I recently received a question about how to copy and paste an Excel sheet from one to another along with their formula. If you have seen my previous video, you have noticed that the formula doesn't get copied over using the read and write range activity. So today I'm going to introduce you a new activity called copy range activity. So let's get right into it. So first of all, let's look at the Excel file we're going to use today. So this is the Excel file that I'm going to use for this video. It has three tabs or uh, three sheets here. Sheets one, two, and three. One and two uh, don't really have formulas in it. So, but within sheet three, uh, there's a column called total. And then under in within these columns, uh, you can see there are formulas that help populating this column. So what I want to do here is to use that copy paste range activities to copy range of this data to another sheet. Uh, let's uh, we'll call it sheet four. We just I would just want to copy this sheet to another sheet within this file. So let's open UiPath Studio. And then uh, before that, I want to show you the Excel UiPath Excel activities version that I use is version 2.10.4. So let's create a sequence for this activity. Um, so to find copy paste range activity can go to app integration and then under Excel and under processing you you can find copies copy range activity and I wanna uh let's pull it let's drag it in and you will see so if you can see it like once you drag it in without the Excel application scope, it will give you an error. So it's mandatory to place these activities within the Excel application scope. So let's drag the Excel application scope in and then put this activity within the scope. Okay. Okay, so it works now. So next thing is just to, uh, we just need to grab the file path. So it's file one. And then the destination cell, uh, it will be the start of this cell, which is A1. And then destination sheets, I will call it sheet four so the things with copy paste range um the destination sheet you defined here uh needs to exist in the uh in the file So I'll show you another activity um, which you can use to just create a, a new sheet uh, that doesn't exist. But we'll use this copy paste range activity first. So destination sheet with sheets four, and then I want to copy sheets three with formulas. And then the range of um, source, which is the range of data you want to copy from sheet three to four, which is all of them. So from A1 to E9. So let's 
So let's So we have everything defined. So destination cell A1, the first cell. And then I want to copy from sheet 3 to 4. And then the range of data I want to copy is from A1 to E9. So let's run this. Okay. I'll just open sheets 4. Voila. So you can see it has been copied over and then let's click on the cell. Yes, the formulas have, have been carried over. So that is how you use the copy range activities to copy formulas from one sheet to another in the same file. So next, I want to show you another activity which can help you to copy formulas from one Excel sheet in a file to a new file. So let's go back to UiPath Studio. And this activity is called copy sheets activity. So just like copy paste activity, um, you need Excel application scope. Without the scope, you get the same error. So you will know as well. So put copy sheets activity within the scope. So next is to browse the file. We want to copy sheets free from file one. So when you click on copy sheets activity, the first thing you want to define is the destination file path. So we want to create a new file. Let's call it file 2. And then Excel file extension. And then the destination sheet name, I'll call it copied sheet. Next thing you want to do is find define the input of the sheet. Um, the sheet that we want to, we want to copy is sheet three from file one. So that is all. Let's, let's run the workflow. Okay. Fresh. We have file two. Yes, you can see within file two, I have my new tab, my new sheet called copied sheet, and then within the sheet, I have my range of data and and the column with my formulas. So uh, that is all. This is how you copy formulas from one Excel sheet to another, um, either within the same file or in a different file. So I hope this is helpful and let me know if you have any questions. I will make a video or try to answer in the comment section. I hope you find this video useful. Please like or subscribe to the channel to receive notification for new videos. Please leave a comment or ask me questions in the comment section and I'll respond. I'll see you next time. Ciao.